Police in New Jersey are searching for the driver who struck an 11 year old boy. It happened earlier this week in North Bergen. Now, thankfully, the boy is okay. CBS 2's Christy Kalishian reports his family is looking for answers. This fifth grader was just two blocks away from school when the SUV going downhill on his right didn't stop and struck his side. His phone flying out of his hand, he managed to get up. Thank God. Right. Like, thank God. I was like, he just called me mama. I got, I got, I got hit. And I was so confused. We're just concerned and really disgusted by the fact that the driver had not at one, any point did he ever stop. Worried parents Belen and Kevin Ben Cosme, who didn't want to share their son's identity, say he was taken to the hospital Tuesday with a minor eye injury. And police are looking for the driver of that gray 2020 to 2024 Ford Explorer who ran the stop sign and kept going. It has tinted windows and a slightly tinted windshield. It also has New Jersey license plates. However, they're occluded with that uh, dark plastic cover. North Bergen police are working with state police. We're confident that soon we're going to identify that license plate. We do need help from the public. Just have some responsibility and to, and to be careful, and especially when you're near the schools. The 11-year-old telling us in Spanish, Yo me siento un poco. He can't understand why that driver, who he thought was going to stop at the stop sign, didn't help him. He still feels a little pain, but says that going back to school on a field trip Thursday made him feel better. His parents encouraging him to go back to school. We're talking, we decide, like, no, you have to go. There's no way, there's no other option. As for the woman pushing a stroller in the video, police have identified her and will interview her as a witness. The boy thanks her for helping him. And says he loves her very much. Neighbors say there has since been a crossing guard here, but the boy is taking a different route to school on a street with more pedestrians. In North Bergen, Christy Kalishian, CBS 2 News.